The first of the medals are about to be competed for at the FIFA Under-17 Women's World Cup. Ghana and Germany know each other pretty well from a meeting in Dalga. The uh, Europeans prevailed then. No African team has been this far before, but just as Ghana can make history, so can Germany. Third in 2008, they're looking to take home bronze mementos again. Playing down the right side, it would appear today. Uh, again is Joanna Titka, and in front of her will be Vivian Bile from Jena, who gets a first-time shot away, and Golgi Bradje struggles to make the save, but it took a, an awful long time to complete the stop here. Up there very quickly to Naiba Lawrence, who controls it well. And now needs to push it wide. She does do that to Samaila. Samaila's in behind the last line of defence and gets across in. Here might be a shot for Ghana, and she's lifted it high over the top with the left foot. Still nil-nil. 27 minutes played. Free kick for Germany and another indiscretion by a Ghanaian player. And Al Hassan is uh, going to be cautioned. She was very lucky not to be sent off in the uh, semi-final match against France was Fatima Al Hassan. She was cautioned in that game and might well have got a second yellow card on two or three occasions. That's a good win of the ball for the uh, Germans this time by Wilder. And a foul on Penf Panfil here, and that's another yellow card. And it, she's going off, it's Al Hassan, her second, it's a red card, the second red card of the tournament for a Ghanaian player. And Fatima Al Hassan looks bewildered, but she's going early to the dressing room and leaving her team with a terrific job on her hands. Strangely enough, Ghana have only conceded goals against the European opposition in this tournament. Two to Germany and two to France. They kept blank sheets against Uruguay, China and Japan. And they've kept one again here so far today. Samaila seems to be encouraged and here's a chance. And they're in the lead, incredibly. It's Ghana who score first through Priscilla Rothier. And Germany are paying the penalty here for some waywardness at the other end of the field. Against all the odds, the Africans, the Black Maidens, are in front here in Baku. String. That white line of defenders all come out together again. It's Kanak, and it's too high. She created the space for the shot, but couldn't keep the ball down. 15 seconds away, Ghana now, from the most famous victory in women's football for an African nation. They've done it, I'm pretty sure. The referee looks at the watch. She's going to blow the whistle and Ghana against all the odds of achieved bronze medal position in the Under-17 Women's World Cup of 2012. Priscilla Rocquier scored what turned out to be the only goal of the game. And Ghana win it by a goal to nil. Germany are desolate. Ghana take bronze.